It's really sad to see how society picture and label us as nerds. Whoa! Okay, this is Black and Repent, and thank you guys so much for coming back to my channel. However, if you're new to my channel, then please consider to subscribe because you can find a lot of my resources here on my channel. I also like to interact a lot with my viewers just like this, so that we can make sure that you enjoyed the time here. Today, we are going to read an email from a subscriber. His name is Diogo, and I actually asked him for his permission to do so already. What I will do is, I will just read the email for you guys, and I'll give you guys my thoughts along the way. And I think a lot of you guys can relate to Diogo, just like I do as well. So listen carefully. All right, here we go. Dear Black Pen Red Pen, I'm a 15-year-old boy from Portugal. Yes, I'm not far away. That just shows the reach your amazing videos have. I have been subscribed to your channel for a long time now, and I'm writing you because I feel the necessity to thank you for how much you have taught me, and I'm sure a lot of people feel the same. And I will also like to thank you as well, Diego, for your message and for your support, for you to watch my videos and all that. I also want to thank everybody who have been supporting me throughout these years. It's just amazing that right now I can just make videos and then people will watch it all over the world. And by the way, for the people who don't know, I'm a community college teacher here in the Los Angeles area. And in my free time, I just make math videos for you guys. And if you guys can see the clock, it's 9.50 p.m. at night on Sunday night, okay? So I was recording some videos for my calculus class earlier. I love doing so, and then, um, you know, hopefully you guys can find my contents to be helpful. Thank you guys for much for the support. Okay, let's continue. I am a quiet subscriber. I don't comment your videos or share them a lot. But that doesn't change the fact that I am always there. Thank you. I watch them all and learn tons of cool stuff with them because that's what math is. Math is something really cool and no one should be ashamed to say that he or she truly loves it. Man, I can feel your passion by reading this, Diogo, and I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys can feel the same as well. You can feel his love, his passion, about math and at such a young age 15 years old is amazing you know let me just tell you guys a little thing right here though the reason that i started my youtube channel back in 2013 the honest reason that i started my channel it was because i knew it would help me to get jobs and seriously that, that's it that's it that was my honest reason okay why i started my youtube channel back in the days so during that time, I was just doing a lot of homework solutions videos and so a lot of test prepping videos and all that. I all love them onto Black and Repent, of course, with literally Black and Repent. And I will include a link to my YouTube channel on my resumes. In that year, I did get a teaching position here at this college. I truly believe that that's one of the reasons why that made me stand out among all the applicants. But my YouTube channel didn't grow that much. It was the time that I started to do math for fun. And it's actually this video right here. E to the pi versus pi to the e. That's the video that actually got my channel going because there was one day it's like, oh man, I just want to do some math for fun. Like seriously. And one of the beauties of doing the YouTube channel is that nowadays I can just teach whatever I want. It's very, very nice. And I'm so grateful that a lot of you guys enjoy my contents as well so thank you and i truly believe do what you love of course you will feel happier and hopefully you can also find the other people who have similar passion with you and that will be just so wonderful it's really sad to see how society picture and label us as nerds who just follow our passion that is math and that is one of the reasons why I admire so much your passion and the love for math is just contagious. I always, I have always loved math and I always thought no one loved it more than I do. But now I understand that the idea is completely wrong because your love for it is truly inspirational. 
Thank you. And let me address what you said right here. That it's sad to see how society picture us and label us as nerds. And I can relate to this because when I came to the United States, I was 14 years old and I started high school here. I didn't speak much English, so I was really quiet in all my classes. I was pretty good in math, but you know because I wasn't talking to too many people, so I was kind of being isolated, and people were labeling me as nerds. Well, it was the time that I met my teachers. Yes, Mr. Salas, he helped me to get my first job at McDonald's. That made me to go out to really talk to people, and of course, I had good math teachers as well. Mr. Hill and also Mr. Schneider. Mr. Hill is my algebra two teacher, and Mr. Schneider is my AP calculus teacher. Mr. Schneider is the one who first hired me as a math tutor, which is about two months after I got a job at McDonald's. So math tutor is my second job. And when I was starting to tutor other students in my school, that's the time that I started to really communicate with the classmates, with other classmates as well. And that's the time I really to make friends, and I think this was really nice. I will encourage you to try to talk to more people, and you know, try to help them out. Try to talk to the things that you both have in common. And I will tell you, once you get into college, once you start majoring in math, once you are in the math department, you can really, really enjoy it to be surrounded by a lot of other math majors as well. And now let's continue. The joy in your eyes. On old videos, and your way of explaining, combined with all the fun you turn things to, makes your videos the best when it comes to YouTube math channels by far. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I also want to thank everybody who have been leaving really supporting comments on my channel. Seriously, you guys' comments are the ones that keep my days going and keep my energy going. They are just like the fuel to keep my YouTube channel going. I wrote this letter because you deserve to know how much you mean to me, and how much influence you can have on one's life, even if that person is from really far away, like me, for example. Again, I just cannot believe that I'm still in disbelief as of now. That my videos are reaching to the people around the world. Seriously, it's just unbelievable. P.S. I have been studying methods for solving cubic equations, mostly the Cardano-Cartaglia formula. I would be really thankful if you could make one video about it, and maybe if you know any method to solve quadratic equations, I think it will also be interesting if you could share it. I will see what I can do because, in fact, the cubic formula is on my. To do this, and the quadratic equation, the quadratic formula is actually also doable. It's kind of similar, but they are tough. But I will see what I can do for you. <laughs> Please continue to make your amazing videos and bring joy to all of us, your beloved subscribers. Thank you. Thank you so much for everything you have taught me. I will forever be grateful. Again, thank you, teacher. Here goes. So this is the email, and thank you so much for the email. And I think I will continue to do this. I have a few more other messages that I want to share with you guys, and you can also send me anything if you guys want me to do this as a video, right? This is just so wonderful, and I still cannot believe I have over like a quarter million subscribers right now. It's amazing! It's amazing! It's amazing! Thank you, thank you, thank you, and as always, that's it.